morning, Falcons. I'm Gilbert Reyes. And I'm Sarah Nicole. And this is the Falcon Report. Now to fast. Hey, Falcons. My name is Ivan, and if you need help in social studies, go to 2007 Miss McKee's room for fast tutoring. Let's go to Lisa with today's clubs. Good morning, Falcons. Here's what's happening with today's clubs. Tomorrow, Spanish Club will meet to eat some sweet treats and discuss club activities during lunch in Senior Gessel's room 2515. The last chess club meeting for this year will be today at 3 p.m. in room 2605. And the other clubs meeting today are JSA Club in room 2007, Key Club at 7 p.m. in the Commons, Math Club in room 1537, and AP Spanish meets with Week Club in room 2204. That's all for today's clubs. See you tomorrow, Hanford. Use a robot to deliver your Valentine. The Hanford High Engineering Club will deliver Valentines to students in their fourth hour classes with Hanford's robot. Purchase Valentines for $3 or two for $5 during lunch. Today's the last day to do so. Valentines will be delivered on February 14th during fourth hour classes. Fill out a card with the name of the Valentine and their fourth hour teacher. Contact a member of the Engineering Club for more information. Here is a special announcement about the blood drive. Attention Falcons who are participating in the blood drive this year. The Red Cross is complying with American Association of Blood Banking guidelines to prevent iron deficiency in blood donors. Ferritin is a protein that stores iron in the body's tissues and is a better indicator of risk for developing iron deficiency anemia long before the hemoglobin is affected. The ferritin test measures your body's level of stored iron, which is needed to build new red blood cells to replace those lost during the donation process. The regular hemoglobin test will be performed to make sure those levels fall within a normal range and then an additional sample of blood will be sent to the lab for the ferritin test. Starting in February of 2018, ferritin testing will be performed on all donors under the age of 19. If a donor's ferritin level is found to be outside of the acceptable range, then that donor will be deferred, one year for females and six months for males. Students should eat iron-rich foods a minimum of two weeks prior to the blood drive. If there are further questions, please talk to Mrs. Fenton. Are you having trouble finding a place to park? Additional parking spaces have been added along the George Washington Way access road by the Varsity Baseball Field. These spaces are currently being underutilized and are available for students. Please ensure that you are parking in actual parking spaces. Those parked outside the lines or in inappropriate locations may be subject to school discipline and or fines. Today is the first day for pennies for patients. Please bring your money to your second period class. The class with the most collected at the end of the week will receive a lunch from Olive Garden. Falcon, show how much you appreciate your favorite teacher, and you could also earn an easy $500. Barnes & Nobles is holding a My Favorite Teacher contest. Write an essay, poem, or a thank you letter explaining how a teacher has influenced your life. Entries must be 500 words or less. All entries are due by March 2nd at Barnes & Nobles. Applications will be available in the library and the office if you are interested. Congratulations to Hanford's Meet a Wee Club for being selected as the 2018 We Volunteer Now grant recipient. The club earned a $250 grant, which they will be using to purchase dog or cat food and other supplies for the Benton Franklin Humane Society. Congratulations and way to represent our school, Falcons. Now to film releases. Bringing the cinema to your home. What's up Falcons, I'm Spencer Bodine and welcome back to Film Releases. For today, Star Wars The Last Jedi. I honestly don't understand the division amongst people over whether or not this movie was actually good. Personally, I really liked it. I thought it was great. I liked the characters, I liked the writing, I liked the story. I don't get what people are talking about when they rag on it. It's almost like I remember that there's going to be a third movie that will most likely address all the complaints people like throwing around for no reason. If you ask me, it was an amazing movie. That's all I can say without an army of angry fans charging me in the halls. Here's hoping that Solo doesn't divide us amongst ourselves like this. Ah, who am I kidding? It probably will. Next time, I'll be reviewing a revival of a childhood favorite, Jumanji, Welcome to the Jungle. 
That's all for today. I'm Sarah Nicole. And I'm Gilbert Reyes. And this has been The Falcon Report. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.